Welcome back to my day in the life vlog. As always, my current day started on the night before. I create tomorrow's schedule, list to do's, prioritize, and add each one to a time block. Usually I put all the tasks on sticky notes and then I put them on a Kanban in order to keep track of my progress. Unfortunately, I was super tired, so I had to go to bed. Well, at least I know what tomorrow's priorities are. Good morning. As always, I start the day with coffee, Americano with two shots of espresso. I also light up the prosperity corner using battery powered flickering candles. They're from M. Mirren and they flicker like real candles. Now that it's fall, it's also pumpkin spice latte season. And the Starbucks creamer is just perfect. Now that I have coffee, I can function. Let's take a look at my schedule today. Now this may be unusual for an adult, but I color code each time block with a color pencil. It's rather therapeutic for me and a great way to calm my mind and start the day. Now I task out all my to-dos on post-its and put them up on a Kanban. Really should have done this last night, but I was so tired. Looks like a busy day ahead and I'm looking forward to it. Now I go upstairs and get ready. I brush my teeth with the Aquasonic Black Series, which I highly recommend. My foundation of choice is the MAC Studio Scoped. For eyeshadow, I'm using L'Oreal Color Tattoo. To straighten my hair today, I'm using the Chi 1 inch straightener. It's my go-to hair tool. Not only does it tame my wild hair, it keeps my hair shiny and lustrous. I've used it for over 20 years and I just love it. Now I'm ready to tackle the day. First and foremost, I meditate and visit my vision board. This is my ritual to start the day with intention. Now I'm on to my second cup of the day using the caramel macchiato creamer, which is equally delicious. I meet with a business coach. We review my goals and progress. Now that I'm getting closer to taking the exam, I need all the help that I can get. At 9 a.m., I'm at a study session. After that, I eat a quick breakfast of frozen pizza. Now I study on my own. Today, I go over a chapter two. The material is dense, but it's not too hard. What helps me the most are end of chapter quizzes, practice questions, and vocabulary. It's important to pick a good brokerage after passing the exam. That's why I'm starting the interviewing process early so I can make the wisest choice in the near future. My interview is going well, but the 50-50 commission split was a bit high. Immediately after, I'm at a mastermind group. In order to be successful, I have to network. So I might as well start early. Now I'm in a live training, but the information is a bit stale. And rush out the door to get our daughter. She has her annual appointment, and here we are, rushing to the appointment. For the first time, we're early. Just enough time to enjoy the autumn leaves. After the appointment, we stop by a nearby store. Looks like it's pumpkin season. Fall is in full bloom. We grab dried mango slices, our family's favorite snack. Finally, I have time for a real meal. It's a delicious curry-flavored ramen. But first, mango slices. Mmm, they are delicious. I study some more. I finish chapter two, review key concepts and vocabulary, and finally, finish my ramen. The is really dry, but I'm determined to pass my test the first time. Speaking of, it's time to log in to my study group. Today just happens to be questions about Washington State. 
I got nine out of ten questions wrong, but that's okay. I'm still learning. The study group finished at five, and we have to leave at five forty-five. So I'm at the garage gym, getting a very quick workout. Staying fit is important for my lifestyle as a mom. Now I'm on the road to our kids' school for curriculum night. It's always exciting learning about what my kids are learning. I haven't been in a traditional classroom forever, so tonight's quite the experience. We spend over two and a half hours at curriculum night, and then half an hour in traffic. Oh my gosh, we're still stuck. <laughs> well, we finally make it home. Everyone went to bed, and I'm back at my desk planning for tomorrow. I then write my daily retro, and also a gratitude journal. Finally, I relax to a glass of wine, sit back, and watch Netflix. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.